What's up, nerds? So today I am quite excited. I am going to be opening, unboxing, and uh, building the and reviewing the Wizarding World Harry Potter drum strang ship, the 3D puzzle. Um, this thing, sorry about the glare. This thing is so stinking cool. I wanted this thing, and as soon as I found it, like I was just like, oh my gosh, I need it. It's so cool. I just, I just love it. It looks, it's so great. Um, I, it's just so cool. I can't handle, I can't tell you how excited I am right now. It's just, this is just going to be so much fun and everything. And, um, I hope you guys, you know, enjoy the ride with me and everything or the ship, uh, the ship, uh, voyage. Um, but this thing just looks so stinking cool and it'll go great in my office, which is Harry Potter themed and everything. Cause I just love that whole world. And, uh, yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to stop chatting and we're going to dive into this sucker. Here we go. <laughs>
All right, you guys. So that is the Durmstrang uh, ship from Harry Potter done by Cityscape. Um, so listen, I have some things to say about building this. Um, it was a pain in the ace and I hated every minute of it. Uh, you know, um, it's, it's made out of card, like a foam and cardboard and stuff. And you had some hanging Chad situations. That was really annoying. Um, you know, some of the pieces didn't fit very like well, um, you know, and, uh, you know, some of the stuff bent when you didn't want it to bend. Cause you had to push it in the little in the little like toggly things. I don't know how to explain it. Like, like you'd have the hole and you're trying to push it in there, but the, the, the piece was a lot bigger than the hole. So you try to push it in there and then that would bend. And I'm all like, it was very annoying. Um, but at the same time, I'm happy that I have this in my collection. It's huge. It is so tall. I have no idea where I'm going to put it at. I think I'm going to put it over here. I think that's the only space it's going to fit in. Um, I have a small table here that I have uh, some umbrage stuff on, but I'm going to have to switch the head up a little bit because it's it's a huge item um, and my office is only so big. Um, but I mean, like I said, I'm not I'm I'm not uh, I don't regret having it slash getting it. Um, building it was a big pain in the ace. Uh, if you have this and you built it and you're like, I usually love stuff like this. Um, but this was just really an undertaking that just, it, it took me, I would say a good night, eight to nine hours to build this thing. Um, and I did it over a course of like four days, just because like after a couple hours, I was just like, all right, I got to take a break from this because it's getting annoying. Um, it kept sliding off this little base right here. It kept sliding back and forth. Um, you know, doing the underbelly here and these little things right here were was the biggest pain in the ace. I had to glue a couple of them down because they kept popping out. Um, they wouldn't reach all the way to the little the little holes and everything. It was just it was very frustrating. And like I said, normally I love stuff like this, like little like dioramas and stuff like that, but this one was very taxing. And I think maybe it was because it was a, a puzzle, a 3D puzzle um, slash it was not. And I thought from the the uh, picture on the box, I thought it was gonna be made of plastic. I didn't realize it was gonna be made of this like foamy stuff with paper on top of it. Um, I did think it was gonna be plastic, you know, and, and you know, the kind where you don't have to paint it and you kind of like just connect to this stuff and everything. I was incorrect. I get that. Uh, that that was on me because I just assumed. But like I said, it's just uh, I don't regret getting this. I just wish that it was just a little bit easier to build slash deal with because it was it was literally like a pain in the ace. Like, I mean, I can get frustrated and upset, but like there were times where like the tiniest little noise would like annoy me. And I'm all like, this is very frustrating. This, 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 this derm strang chip. No wonder those derm stranger are, are upset all the time or whatnot. <laughs> well, Kakarov was, um, but again, uh, I'm, I'm glad that I have it in my collection. I'm not like, uh, I don't regret getting it slash having it in my collection. I do. I think it's a good piece to have. Um, if you're somebody like me and you love stuff like this, uh, but I would just say like, this was, like I said, it was very taxing just as far as building it. It was very frustrating just because the pieces just didn't fit together. And like, like it tore off some of the paper at some points in time. And I'm happy that I went through the back because then, uh, you know, it tore the paper where you can't see it. Um, some of the things bent like up here, this top part right here, as I was pushing it down, the, it bent in the middle and I was afraid that it wouldn't get fixed. And later on, I might have to go and actually glue something to it to keep it straight, like maybe cut uh, uh, like a, a, a piece of wood and glue it there to make sure it stays and stuff. I'm not sure what I'm gonna have to do, but yeah. So tell me, what do you guys think about this? Is this something that you want in your collection? Is this something that you're interested in? Do you have this and you didn't have any problems like, you know, dealing with the the nonsense I was talking about and uh, and all that stuff? Or, you know, are you like me and you got a little bit frustrated because um, it might have taken a little bit too long or, you know, there was just, you know, you had problems with it bending 
you know, all that stuff, you can go ahead and leave all your comments in that section down below. If you like this video, go and hit that like button. You know, I won't mind. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys on my next uh, video. You guys have a good day. A la kazoo. Hey guys, if you like this, go ahead and check out my main channel at Geek What. Link in the description down below. If you want to help support me even more, you can check out my merch store also in the link down below. Thanks so much. I really appreciate it.